Today, we wanted to go out into our community and gauge what local businesses are experiencing. So we sent Six on Your Side reporter Jordan Brown to Market Square. And Jordan, what has business been like for downtown restaurants, say, in the past week or so? Well, Lori, with all that's been going on nationally and locally, it's been a lot for the businesses that help keep our city's economy coming. I spoke to a couple of the restaurants in Market Square to find out how all of this is impacting them. From pandemic to protests. It's been challenging. Um, it's really taken everything we've had to sustain uh, for ourselves, for our staff members. The last few months have been uncertain for local businesses. Many restaurants are trying to get back on their feet after taking a serious financial hit during the COVID-19 pandemic. Cafe 4 in Market Square just recently reopening their dining area. We started curbside after shutting down for almost eight weeks. You know, curbside was going okay. We had great support from a lot of community members. We really appreciated all the business, but it was nothing like being open. The Tomato Head restaurant also just barely making it through the pandemic. We have two locations of the Tomato Head restaurant. Uh, the location on Kingston Pike was kept open for to-go orders the whole time. Uh, that's really what kept us afloat. And now recent turmoil in our country has caused increased activity in the downtown area, but peaceful protests have actually drawn more business to local restaurants. If anything, it helped us. Uh, we had a few, you know, hungry and tired people coming in after the protest and um, we fed them. <laughs> and as Knox County continues with phase two, both businesses tell me they hope customers will continue to come in. They're still closely following guidelines, keeping customers at a safe distance, wearing masks and disinfecting. We've seen an increase in sales and customers uh, as the phases have moved on. I know uh, that we are ready for phase three to finish out and be back to what we call normal. It's, we're just anticipating that arrival. And the Knox County Health Department will assess the status of phase two on June 12th and will make potential recommendations at that time.